In this paper, we propose a new method to reconstruct noisy and incomplete posture captured by the Microsoft KineNet. With the raw posture captured, which is shown as the yellow skeleton, we estimate the reliability for each body part. Those with no reliability values are rendered as red. Considering the reliability values, we synthesize a new posture using local principal component analysis. We map a character onto the reconstructed posture for easier visualization. We use a motion database to reconstruct the KineNet postures. It consists of bossing, walking, object handling, up body movement, and sword fighting motions. The first experiment tests how well our system reconstructs basic user postures. Notice that Kin has failed to track the arms when it's out of the capture area. Our system reconstructs the posture successfully. In the second experiment, the user interacts with a boss. Notice the unstable hand movement from the kinest posture when they are occurred. Those movements are repaired in our synthesized postures. The occlusion becomes more serious when the user holds a large piece of paper. The proposed algorithm improves the result significantly. Here, the user approaches a chair and sits on it. In the sitting pose, some body parts such as the hands cannot be seen. We estimate those parts by posture optimization. Here, Kinet captures the user playing with a basketball. Sometimes it incorrectly considered ball as part of the legs when they overlap. We identify and correct the unreliable parts. In previous methods that simply replace missing parts with the best match in a database search, there are serious visual artifacts. This is because of the lack of reliability measurements and posture optimization framework. Without reliability measurement, posture optimization alone cannot perform accurately, as the wrongly tracked paths confuse the system. Here, we show the results obtained by our method with the reliability estimation. The synthesized posture closely resembled the user performed movement. In this experiment, we analyzed the accuracy of the posture reconstructed by our system. We capture full body motion with KineNet, but using the left hand and the left foot only to reconstruct the posture. As expected, the results contain a large amount of error. Using both hands, upper body motion can be reconstructed reasonably well, although there are some noises in the lower body. With the 4N effector used, the system can accurately reconstruct most postures, except those involving knee and elbows movements.
by considering the hands, feet, elbows, and knees, reconstruct posture are very similar to the user performed movements. Finally, the results when all body parts are used is soon.